Hi V Entertainment, I'm Melinda Bam, your new Miss South Africa for 2012. I'm here at Camelot Spa for a lovely day of pampering. Why don't you join me? Hi, nice to meet you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Today on Melinda we'll be doing a massage called the Reflex Foot Massage. With this massage we'll be doing pressure points on the feet, relieving stress and tension in the areas that she has problems with. I've been asked the question so many times if it's sunk in yet or anything, um, especially the first week after and then it most certainly didn't. Um, but after the holiday and just actually, actually thinking about the whole year and thinking about everything that I have planned, I think it's slowly starting to dawn on me that it's actually happening. I'm living my dream at the age of 22 and it's overwhelming, but it's extremely exciting. I don't think people really understand what the dynamics is behind the scenes and everything. It is the biggest rush you can imagine. Um, running around, like taking off your shoes, combing your hair in the run, putting lip gloss on. It's, it's insane. Um, when you get off stage, you literally zip this one's dress down, you help her with her buckle, she pulls your zip down. It's, it's hectic, but it's so much fun. Everyone's giggling and laughing and running. So the interaction with the girls was extremely nice. Um, I don't think you could have wished for anything better. Melinda um, It's been a little over a month now. The first week and a half, I literally went from one interview into the next. Um, had a couple of interviews on radio, TV, um, newspaper, which was great because I think the exposure that I've got was absolutely amazing. This far, when I actually look at my diary, I do have a little bit of free time here and there, but it's still early in the year. I'm sure that later on I will have none. Um, but if I have free time, I'll most definitely try and go home and just spend a little bit of time with my mom and my sister. Um, my dad is in Dubai, so whenever he comes to visit, then I'll definitely just to try and go home for a while. Um, and then just to stay active and still go to the gym. I don't want my lifestyle to change too drastically because I travel a lot because I know that training and, and maintaining a healthy lifestyle helps me with my energy levels on a day-to-day -day basis. Some of the things that I'd like to change during my reign or just to actually plant a seed in the mindset of people is just to change the whole mindset around South Africa. and. If you can change somebody's mindset, you change the perception of their future. And to me, my actions follow my perceptions on my future. So if I think that tomorrow will be a better day or that I will be able to succeed something, if you can actually make that, chi that change and occupy your mind with that, then your actions will actually follow. You should always know where you come from in, to enable you to know where you're going. I started relatively late doing modeling. My mom was very protective over me. She didn't want me to take away any of my attention towards my schoolwork and everything. I've done FHM calendar, which was great. I made plenty of friends there. And it's definitely something that I think was a, a season of my life and a, a good business decision for me as well. I know there's nothing wrong with a woman being sexy and I'll never portray myself in a way that I don't want people to to think that's inappropriate for a Miss Essay. I wouldn't look back at it and regret it at all. I don't know if I'd do it any time in the near future again, but I think the job description as a Miss Essay is something completely different than being a model.